I'm burning my hand. Uh, <laughs> and it is time for broiling, basting, and baking with Penny. That's me. And today, our guest is Marshall Good, a fine old gentleman. <laughs> Hi, Penny. <laughs> Thanks for having me on your cooking show. <laughs> oh, and what is your recipe today? Hmm? I call it trail goulash. Oh, lordy me, how whimsical. <laughs> and what goes into your trail goulash? Anything I can pick up or catch. Oh, heavens to Murgatroyd, you are going to have to be more specific than that, Marshal Good. Well, there's lots of stuff out in the desert. Mm -hmm. If you boil cactus long enough, it's almost edible. Oh, I'm sorry, but our viewers don't want almost edible. They want delectable. And that's why they tune in to broiling and basting and bacon with Penny. Uh, that's why I always toss in a dozen grasshoppers or so. You see, they add flavor. Oh, mercy me, Marshal Good. That's disgusting. Roots, grass, sagebrush, tree bark, they all go into trail goulash, too. Oh, this is... It just isn't working out, is it, Marshal Good? Just get out of here, old-timer. Well, just about anything I find out of the desert goes into the pot. Now, listen, I boil the whole mess for six hours. Then I let it simmer for about a week. After a week, I scrape off the top and slurp up what's underneath. It's good eating. <laughs> Whatever's left can be used as roofing material or for street repair. Oh, oh mercy sakes alive. I do, I do believe you've set cooking shows back 20 years. Say bye-bye. Am I leaving? No, I am. Penny has to go toss her cookies now. That was revolting, old timer. Just don't ever come here again.